They're off. Awkward early strides for Brooks all in. From the inside, Star of Tomorrow is driving off to the early lead. Honeycamp was away well today. And then on the inside, Peaceful Moment. Up to the outside, Rowdy Daisy. Rowdy Daisy into third. Peaceful Moment fourth. Coro Mandel had a little bit of a stuttering start. And she's a joint fourth on the outside. Then a gap of some four back to the gray twinkling Irish. And then preordained and Brooks all in. Three furlongs to the finish here, and they're chasing Tyler Bays and Star of Tomorrow, and they're leading Honey Camp by a length and a half. And then comes Rowdy Daisy on the outside. She's keeping Coro Mandel inside as they come for the top of the stretch. Preordained is racing in fifth on the outside and showing a bit of interest. Peaceful Moment is under urging at the inside, three sixteenths of a mile to go. Here's Honey Camp in the pink. Outside of her is Rowdy Daisy. Farther out is Preordained. Star of Tomorrow still hanging tough right on the inside. It's Rowdy Daisy, Star of Tomorrow. Preordained up on the outside. Star of Tomorrow has fought off the challenges. Can she hold on to the wire? It looked like she held off Rowdy Daisy, but heads were up and down. A photo there. Preordained loomed and ran third. And they're off. Jingle got out behind the rest. Toward the inside, Primer Dimer is taking the early lead here, and Space Odyssey is right with him. Generator on the inside. And then comes Zaffa. Zaffa into third, Generator fourth. Jingle recovering from a slow start is racing into fifth. And then to the outside comes Stud Puppy. The back two are Egomaniac and Major Kong. And we have a solitary leader here as Primer Dimer and Isaac Castillo have sprinted clear. And they're a good four, four and a half lengths clear of Space Odyssey. Primer Dimer on the inside and Zaffa up three wide. Then a gap of some four and a half again. Back to Generator, Stud Puppy, and Ego Maniac. And Major Kong has let them go, and he's a fairly distant trailer as they move up the backstretch here. It's Primer Dimer in front, a shorter lead now as Space Odyssey is hustled into a closer second, and Zaffa up on the outside, maintains a three-wide path in third, and back to the inside. Jingle is very prominent here as they continue their nine-furlong journey. He's about three lengths off the lead, then it's an enormous chasm back to the rest. Stud Puppy and Generator, Egomaniac and Major Kong. Midway around the turn for home. Primer Dimer leads at Space Odyssey, is called on for his best. Then Zoffa, Jingle on the inside, is fourth. As they straighten away past the quarter pole and into the stretch, Space Odyssey is making his move on the outside of Primer Dimer, and Space Odyssey goes up to Primer Dimer and sticks a neck in front. Primer Dimer tries to fight back. Jingle is starting to make a late impression, but still has a length and a half, two lengths to close in on Space Odyssey. Primer Dimer is game. Jingle trying to catch Space Odyssey. Space Odyssey, though, wins it. Half length to Jingle and Primer Dimer, and then four back to Major Kong. And they're off. Hopping start for the favorite, June Gloom. And he is last by two or three lengths. And June Gloom is also climbing or racing very awkwardly at the back end of the field. 
Back to the front end here. Meet Joe leads the way to cost basis. Then it's two and a half to morning snow. Tapping for a dance in the yellow is fourth. Sam Tequila is outside of him in fifth. Gap of three then to the mayor, Crystal Crescent, who is outside of Shanghai's dream. And June Gloom remains the trailer with three furlongs to the finish. He is double digits off the lead and already being asked by Christian Torres after that rugged beginning and odd initial stages as they come to the top of the stretch. Cost Basis now has the lead. Meet Joe and the Orange has dropped out of it. Cost Basis finds himself on a three-length cushion. And then Morning Snow, Sam Tequila is racing in third. Back to the inside, tapping for a dance as they come through the stretch into the finish. Cost Basis is going to take it. Cost Basis and Kylie Jordan are going to stroll home here by three and a half. Morning Snow second, Sam Tequila fairly distant third, and tapping for a dance fourth. The thrill of thoroughbred racing is always available with Oaklawn Anywhere. Because Arkansas residents can bet on races from all over the world with any smartphone, laptop, or tablet. Anytime, from anywhere. Download the Oaklawn Anywhere app. Sign up now, and you can qualify for a bonus of up to $150. Best of all, Oaklawn Anywhere is a free betting service with no subscription fees. Bet online anytime with Oaklawn Anywhere, Arkansas's exclusive window to worldwide racing. What's your Oaklawn? Maybe it's relaxing at our world-class spa or unwinding in a completely different way. It could be an evening at the Oak Room and Bar, late night dancing at Pop's Lounge, or just lazy mornings at your own pace. And our location in Hot Springs makes Oaklawn the perfect place to discover everything the Spa City has to offer. Explore the possibilities and make your reservations at oaklawn.com. What's your Oaklawn? And they're off. Out toward the inside, Lori's Eyes is moving out quickly for the lead with Quarantined on the inside and Flash of Cherokee from between horses. Those three are hammer and tongs early on. And then comes Miss Double, who's racing in fourth. Outside of hers, Nellie Larkin in fifth. Reeking Havoc is sixth. She's wide on the outside with a half mile to go, but in the clear and six lengths from the lead. Then a gap of three and a half or four. Back to May Disco and True Blue Girl around the turn. On the inside, it's quarantined. This 11-to-1 shot with a narrow lead here. Flash of Cherokee is alongside her. Lori's eyes is looming toward the outside three wide and now wreaking havoc in the purple and black. Four wide into the stretch. Nellie Larkin is following, then May Disco toward the inside. It's Lori's eyes. Walter De La Cruz taking the lead here. Up to the outside, wreaking havoc. Ramsey Zimmerman trying to get them. Flash of Cherokee on the inside is third. Final 16th. Lori's eyes wreaking havoc. Lori's eyes and wreaking havoc. Lori's eyes, the longtime maiden. A maiden no more. Wins at a half length. Wreaking havoc second. And then back to Flash of Cherokee and May Disco. And they're off. Atras trying hard on the inside. Black Storm looking for Loki on the outside. Leslie's Gold, Bend in the River, and Rock and Junebug were all out relatively fast as well. And then toward the back end of the field are Sign of the Cross and J.E.'s Hand Me Down, and it's extremely far back. Orbital Star is detached from the field by double digit lengths as they race into the turn. Atras with the advantage by a length. Black Storm is in the clear in second. And then Leslie's gold and looking for Loki to the outside in the yellow and purple. 
Bend in the River has some runners to get around. He's racing fifth toward the inside. Then right to the rail comes Rockin' Junebug. Then J.E.'s Hand Me Down and Sign of the Cross. Here's the final quarter mile. And the long shot Atras takes him to the top of the stretch to Black Storm looking for Loki is starting to kick in a bit up on the outside. Bend in the River is back along the rail and fourth. And then way down the center is Sign of the Cross. Atras is stubborn. And here's looking for Loki. Atris looking for Loki. It's going to be looking for Loki and Atris looking for Loki. Wears him down. Atris is next. Sign of the cross, a good third in his return. Bend in the river fourth. They're in the gate, and they're off. And right from the inside, Whooping Jay wants a piece of the lead. There goes Sand Mountain out there and charging. And from between horses, it's Wesleyan. And then comes Otis, Otis, Otis. He's prominently placed. He is racing in fourth behind that leading trio. Trump Pence to the inside is fifth. And then it's about a three-length break. And Newsbox has given them a decent head start. He's about nine lengths off the lead. And well back from there is Storm and Hong Kong as they round that turn. It's Sand Mountain from the outside. A narrow advantage here. Whooping Jay is right with him on the inside. And now up on the outside, here comes Otis, Otis, Otis. And he's making a menacing move here. And then Trump Pence is dying for racing room. He switches out three wide, and Trump Pence just got shuffled there at the top of the stretch. And Newsbox down the middle of the track still has some room to make up. It's Otis, 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 Sand Mountain to the inside, but here is Newsbox. And he is going to sweep up, and Trump Pence finally has clear sailing, but he's going to be in the second flight as Newsbox from off the pace draws clear. Trump Pence was a troubled second, tight for third, Sand Mountain, or Otis, Otis, Otis. Want to know the most exciting use of your iPhone or iPad? It's the Oaklawn Anywhere app. Oaklawn Anywhere is available in the App Store, and Arkansas residents can download it for free. Then you can bet online anytime on your iPhone or iPad and get cashback rewards. Sign up now, and you can earn as much as a $150 bonus. The Oaklawn Anywhere app opens up a world of top racing action wherever you are. From Oaklawn, home of the Arkansas Derby and the Racing Festival of the South, to racing at tracks across the world, you can bet and watch right from your iPhone or iPad. Bet online anytime with Oaklawn Anywhere, Arkansas's exclusive window to worldwide racing. For more than a century, the people of Arkansas have come to Oaklawn to play, to bet, and to win. Now, we're coming to you. Introducing Oaklawn Sports, the new mobile betting app from Oaklawn. Bet anywhere in Arkansas. Bet with confidence. Bet with Oaklawn. Download the app and start betting today. Oaklawn Sports, Arkansas's trusted brand. Gate. And they're off, and a very slow start for Eli's girl on the inside. Singing Emma wins the break and moves out early on. Funtime girl gets out in second. And then comes total discretion, and to the inside, Vegas Blue, the heavy favorite in the white cap, is moving into third. Total discretion now fourth, and Bayshore Foxes is racing in fifth, about a path off the rail into that turn. Two lengths then to Courageous Cap'n, then Can Can Cutie, and it's quite a way back to Eli's girl and half scout around the turn here. Vegas Blue is up to challenge Singing Emma. Singing Emma with the lead of neck. Vegas Blue is alongside. 
And then comes Bayshore Foxes. She's two lengths back in third. And to the outside, total discretion. Fun Time Girl splits those two in the solid black. Courageous Cap'n has an inside path. 3.16 to go. And Singing Emma toward the inside maintains the lead. And not enough for Vegas Blue. Up on the outside, total discretion. Courageous Cap'n moving into the second flight on the inside. But Singing Emma is gone here, and she's going to take it. Singing Emma, 19 to 1 upset, beats Courageous Cap and then total discretion. Bayshore Foxes fourth. And they're off. Call Me Q from the inside is displaying speed. American Outlaw way well. Commerce Comet is sharing that lead. And Easy Action, the favorite, is right up there as well. In fact, Easy Action, three deep, is third. Call Me Q now fourth. Rivet is outside of him and racing in fifth in the white. Then a length and a half to Rocking Rocket. He's racing back in sixth. And then it's a two and a half length break. Back to Protégé. He's given them about a nine-length head start. Then Mr. Muldoon and Axton broke well today. He came from the clouds last time, and he'll have to cloud it again today as American Outlaw, the son of American Pharaoh, leads the way to the upper stretch here. Commerce Comet drops back from between. Inside of him is Call Me Q, and here's Easy Action cruising up, and wider than that is Rivet. As they straighten away, American Outlaw and Richard Aramia. But here's Rivet up on the outside, fresh off that maiden win gaining ground. Easy action is not going to get there today at a short price. And here is Rivet. And Keith Asmussen, he is going to get there. And Rivet impressively draws clear. Big improvement for him the last couple outs. American Outlaw, good second here. Easy action, a non-threatening third. And Axton picked up some pieces for fourth. And they're off. CC Harbor was slow away from there. And there goes Little Rocker. She's racing off early on. Hey there, Joji Girl, a second. And then to the outside, she be Sheehan. She's racing in third into that clubhouse turn. And then comes Courtney Fay. She's positioned toward the outside. She's about three deep, sharing the fourth spot with Mocha Kiss. Mocha Kiss now fourth. Courtney Fay is in between runners now and racing in fifth. Outside of her is Guest in My Heart. She's caught about four deep onto the backstretch as Little Rocker and Marcelino Pedrosa have the lead to themselves. From behind Guest in My Heart, it's about a two-and-a-half length break to Gold Strategy, then Dancing in the Pulpit. Forty Bug is trying to inch up from along the inside. War Music is at the back along with Early Dismissal, and it's a long way back to CC Harbor with a half mile to the finish. Little Rocker with the lead of length to Mocha Kiss. Hey there, Joji Girl. The gray on the inside is racing a third. Courtney Fay, well within range. She's fourth and gaining up on the outside under Christian Torres. And then from the inside, 40 Bug is racing into fifth. Shebe Sheehan is dropping back. Moving by her gold strategy, War Music is looking for racing room and having to wait back there while appearing to have a bit of energy as they straighten away in the upper stretch. Dropping out of it is Little Rocker on the inside. Here is Courtney Fay roused up on the outside of Mocha Kiss. Mocha Kiss the inside and Courtney Fay. Courtney Fay with a neck in front. Then Mocha Kiss, followed by 40 Bugs. CC Harbor is gaining on the inside. She's still about three lengths back, but closing well. Courtney Fay leads it. CC Harbor gaining on the inside is going to get there. CC Harbor beats Courtney Fay. And then came War Music and Mocha Kiss. <laughs> 